yeah. <clears throat> well, what do you want to look at first? Like, you want to look at, like, jewelry? Then you can just put, like, sterling. You would have to type in, like, sterling silver. Like, what type of jewelry, like, you were interested in? Happy holidays, everyone. So this morning, we're going to start off with some breakfast. I'm using my new Christmas gift. I got my cup from my older boys. It says plant lady on it, if you can't already see it. And I'm obsessed. It looks like a little tiny pot. Isn't it great? So as I was peeling these potatoes, my grandmother and I were having a conversation and she yelled out to me, why are you peeling them? Why don't you just leave the peels on? And that's something that I did all the time when the boys were little. And I don't know, I just started peeling them because I just felt like nobody would like them. My grandma can be a little picky, so I wasn't really sure if she would be the one to poo poo them, but apparently not. So the peels are staying on. So um, if you were to take them off, it's no big deal, but they do have some nutritional value, which is great. My grandmother is starting off her morning at church. Since she can't physically be at church, she will watch it sometimes. That's Pastor Ruben. We used to go to Calvary Chapel um, when Pastor Terry was the pastor. Um, but we, uh, my grandmother, not we, but my grandmother's uh, very close friends with Pastor Ruben's family. So anyway. Now back to breakfast. I am making chiriso potatoes. I would say egg. Uh, chiriso potatoes but when I was at the market I completely spaced and I didn't grab any and we literally have one egg left and that's for our potato salad excuse the train in the background <laughs> oh, careful, baby yeah girl. so like okay? I was saying um, I have one egg and that egg is for our potato salad oh my goodness the train it's like as soon as I start talking <laughs> what the heck of course you can add egg to this. If I had it my way, I would definitely add egg to this dish, but honestly, it's okay if you don't have it. Don't fret over that. I What I did was I just sent this with my boys. They were gonna go visit their grandmother and their grandfather on their dad's side, and they really wanted some chorizo potatoes, so I just made egg, chorizo, and potatoes. That's it. And I asked their grandma if she can just warm up some tortillas for them when they got to her house. And she said, absolutely. So they had breakfast. When I'm cooking chorizo, I don't use any oil. There's really no need to. It's pretty greasy all on its own. So I like to cook it by itself first and take all of that grease out beforehand and then I'll add in the onion. So I did already do that. As you can see, the pan looks much, much drier than it would have normally, and that's all the grease that I was able to get out of there. Now, after adding the onion and stirring that in, I'm gonna just add the potatoes. I hope you try this really quick and easy breakfast recipe. The people that you share it with will not be disappointed. You can definitely eat this on its own, or you can throw it in a tortilla. What I like to do is put it in a bowl and cook a, an egg off to the side on its own. Like I'll fry up an egg and throw that on top with some fresh avocado. Oh my goodness, that is so good. And if you want some more protein, put some beans at the bottom. Delicious.
can have coffee right now. Coffee. And I have, what is it? It's chocolate candy. A chocolate caramel. Mm -hmm. Here it With, Rip it. Okay, rip it up. Thank you, baby. You're so strong. Oh my gosh, what is it? What could it be? Oh, that's not too distant. Hi, Charlie. Hi, buddy. My uncle got these he, for me. He uh, said that I could share them with the kids. <clears throat> yeah, we'll see about that. <laughs> They're not here right now, so all my kids want to go visit the, their other side of the family, so... I'm here by myself and my grandma went with my uncle to go visit my grandpa and I just opted to stay home because um, I have a lot of laundry and stuff that I have to do right now so hey there kitty cat Hi, baby. Yeah, look at these guys. Okay, so let's see what this is. This, it looks, these are all like rice crackers. Um, it looks like probably, it probably has like little nori flecks in it with seaweed. And these, a lot of the time when they're shaped like this, this little crescent, they're spicy. Um, I'm not sure if these will be. I guess we'll have to find out, huh? And this is just, um, normally, <clears throat> normally this is a sweet, sorry, I just sat down right now. Normally this is a sweet, like shoyu, like on here. Um, and then it has the nori wrapped over it, the seed. And this one I'm so excited for. These are delicious, but this one's like one on steroids. Oh my gosh, it's huge. Look at this thing. Like, literally, palm of my hand, seriously. And they have these, but normally they're like these tiny little sticks, you know? No, not this. This is like gigantic. I can't wait to eat that. And there are only three. Uh, those are gonna be the first ones to go. And this little pack, oh gosh, this is so great. This is like the traditional simbe, is what my grandmother, um, we, we grew up calling it simbe. Um, I honestly don't even know what that means. Um, that could just be like the name of this type of snack. But anyway, I absolutely love this. So see how it has like a little bit of everything. It has these cute little flower shaped ones and then like these little square guys and these little sticks. These sticks are pretty much this one, but again, on steroids. Like this is like how they're normally, the normal size of them. They're about this size and they're a little sweet. Like see that one's a sweet one. See what I mean? Like these are like little sweet sticks. Okay. Oh, I'm so excited. Anyway, and then... Uh, these are just probably show you ones. They look like they're gonna be like maybe slightly sweet, salty. So good, you guys! Oh my goodness! I'm so excited. I was so grateful when he bought this because these types of snacks are what I grew up eating. Like this, like we would buy like a big bag of it, and it pretty much is all of these in here. Sometimes they have like not sometimes they do have these bags that are like these. Uh, of just these but they're skinnier and those are the spicy ones they look like little chilies to me so that's why i always think like the little little moon ones are like the spicy ones um so i'm hoping that those are spicy if not no worries because i'm still gonna eat them <laughs> but yeah i'm so excited
right? We're so excited, aren't we? Look at the excitement in those eyes. There we go. <laughs> oh, buddy. Little cutie pie. Thanks for watching.